sorry, I beg your pardon. Once upon a time, in Sweet Haven Village, a one-eyed sailor named Popeye had just docked his boat and made his way up to the village. He was expecting to meet his fiancée after a long time sailing. He stood in the main square, waiting, and waiting, and waiting. Oh, what is he doing now? And all at once I knew, I knew at once, I knew he needed oh, me. Look. here she comes. Olive oil is coming. Isn't she pretty? <laughs> or maybe not. Until the day I die, I don't know why, I knew he needed me. Oh. Or maybe it's because He needs me, 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 he needs me While in the bushes someone was lurking Is it Count Dracula? Is it the Goblin? Maybe Corky? was only Captain Bluto. Bluto is on olive oil looking at Popeye and he got very jealous. The captain decided to make a plan. Ha! And it's done. Ole! He rolls towards Popeye and he hits him on the head. Popeye stands up. Bluto hits him again. Popeye stands up again and... Popeye's gone. Sit up, Popeye. Approaches Olive and she starts screaming and yelling. Pluto grabs her, tie her with a rope, puts her on his shoulders, and runs away with her. In the meantime, Popeye is getting back to senses. Looks for his spinach, finds it, and eats it. He starts looking for Olive. Ha ha ha! He's going for the rescue. On the way, but that's not him for Popeye. He runs away. <laughs> and that's it. Popeye just saved life and hooray! <laughs> Look at that. Popeye has got blue to corner. So let's the fight begin. And 
they lived happily ever after. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoy a nice day here with us in Sweet Haven Village. Now from me, nothing else but goodbye and God bless. And ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, this was uh, the once upon a time. Some men, but some men always outrun some men, and I'll fuck yes, no.